China is conducting a mega air show in the southern city of Zhuhai. A lot of aircraft, drones and naval equipment are on display, but the show has two top attractions. One is a stealth fighter jet. It is called the J-35A. It's being billed as Beijing's answer to America's F-35. The second top attraction is not even Chinese. It's a Russian Su-57 jet. It's on display at this year's air show in China. But what is the Russian jet doing there? And what does China hope to achieve with this display of military might? Our next report tells you. This is the J-35A, a fifth generation stealth fighter jet. It can evade radar detection. It has advanced intelligence features. It can attack at supersonic speeds. The J-35A is China's latest model of the stealth fighter jet and clearly the biggest attraction at the Zhuhai Air Show. Tuesday was the opening of the biennial exhibition. It runs until November 17th. On display are aircraft, drones, missiles and a vast array of other military equipment. They are produced by Chinese companies and it's a way to showcase progress, to flaunt Chinese technology. Take the J-35A for example, they started developing it in 2012. Since then, the model has been reworked multiple times. It is China's answer to the Lockheed Martin F-35. Both even have a similar design, and this is no mere coincidence. In 2016, a Chinese businessman got a 46-month jail sentence. It was for conspiring with Chinese-based hackers trying to steal US military secrets. The main targets were the F-22 and the F-35 fighter jets. So the similarity to the F-35 isn't just inspiration. But Beijing believes it did better. Military commentators in the country can't stop praising the J-35A. They say it can easily overpower its American counterpart. So China is confident about its air power. But that's not all that was on display. For the first time, the air show had a section dedicated to naval power. China's growing fleet of unmanned aircraft and ships. A drone vessel was showcased too. It has been dubbed Killer Whale by Chinese media. China basically wants to show that it's battle ready in case of any conflict in the South China Sea. However, one of the top attractions was not Chinese. It was this jet, Russia's Su-57. It is Moscow's most advanced stealth fighter jet and it was here in China, even being flown by a Russian pilot. It was a big deal for both countries, which is why Putin sent one of his top men to mark the occasion. Sergei Shoigu, the head of Russia's National Security Council, attended this air show. So, Beijing is flexing its military muscle. It's showing that it is battle ready. With its vast display of military power and equipment, Russia is there as a witness and a partner. Their camaraderie is on full display a signal of growing military ties between the two countries. But that's not all that China hopes to achieve. You see, Beijing accounts for just 5.8% of global arms exports. That's negligible, especially compared to the US, which accounts for 42%. But China is trying to bridge the gap by catering to countries in the global south. It wants to attract countries who don't trust Western weapons. Basically, China has two goals here. It wants to showcase its military might in line with Xi Jinping's goal of creating world-class armed forces by 2050. But it also aims to turn into a global exporter of weapons. It's trying to market its weapons and appeal to countries to ditch Western weapons for their Chinese counterparts. This Zuhai air show is the perfect opportunity of killing two birds with one stone.